Hey there, everybody. Steve from Chief Skills saw this post today on Facebook on the, I guess I'm on the eh, Chief Architect Users Group or something. I don't know what it is called, but uh, this gal here is having a issue getting this wall cap to appear right here where she wants it. It's appearing up here. So I thought I'd do a quick video about this and maybe it'll help. Okay, so I just got a little plan right here, nothing fancy, just some walls. And uh, go down here to the straight glass pony wall. And I'm just gonna draw this in real quick. And we will open it, double click on it. And as you can see, my default has a wall cap on it called default wall cap. And if you look here, it, it's there, but if there isn't anything there, then you just click add new. And um, I believe Chief has wall caps in here. Let's see, uh, handrails and caps right here. So you can pick one of these, but really I always just use dash 001. It's just a block of wood right here. It doesn't matter the shape like that. You can just, well, in fact, just make it full wall width like that and then change the height to maybe one. And there's your cap. Now, after you've done that, then I would just take this and make it say six or something and make it whatever you want. And there is your wall cap right where you need it. And then you can just take this wall and drag it over here. Oops, right to the end. Come on, there you go. And we can look at that and you will see that it works and now i had tile for my default there for the wall but yours might be drywall but uh, then if you look at it in vector view you can see it goes to the ceiling and you can click right here and start to drag down and then hit your tab key and just go minus 12 say same over here tab key minus 12 and there you go and then uh, you can just take your door, glass shower door. Where is it? Right here. Stick it in, maybe right here. And your shower is pretty much done. Standard view looks pretty good. Not perfect, but you, you get the idea. And uh, of course, you want to name your room shower, and it'll take that baseboard off and take the baseboard off these walls. But um, that's a, just a quick video on how that works. Now, one other thing, I mean, like if you look look at this for a second, wall types. So you got glass shower on the top and I have this wall on the bottom. See, it's my own wall. But you, you probably will have interior four. It's probably your wall type. And so it'll look like that. And your wall cap might be actually whatever your trim material is. It, so your wall might look like this, but you can change those materials very easily and change this wall like interior for here's here's my wall. I just I actually made it the same materials on all three layers. And there's a reason for that. I don't want to go into right now, but um, you might experiment with that. Uh, and it makes building a curb very easy. That's why I have all three layers that way. Anyway, that's a quick tip on showers. Hope it helps.